Everyone is in love with the idea of earning passive income. For example, buying a product like this LED baton on Alibaba for a dollar or two in bulk, and then selling it on Amazon individually for $11.65 seems like a great idea. This is where a lot of new Amazon sellers are taken off guard because they don't realize that certain fees are taken after every sale. So in this video, I'm gonna explain how Amazon fees work by breaking it down using a real product example. If you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe and turn on that notification bell so you don't miss any new videos I release. And this is the product we're gonna be talking about and breaking down. I'm going to show you the cost to manufacture, cost to ship, and Amazon fees, and roughly what advertising fees would cost, and what the end of the day net profit would be. Because although you'll sell this item for $11.65 in this case for the seller, Amazon takes a cut and certain fees go out, and you're only left with a certain percent of profit. So what I'd recommend, do all of your research on Google Chrome, that web browser. And if you type in the Chrome web store on Google, there is a tool, a free tool I'd highly recommend getting. It's called AMZ Scout Calculator. So if we search that, I already have it downloaded here. Amazon FBA Calculator free by AMZ Scout. And it allows us to see all the fees. So if we come onto this listing and I already have it downloaded, what I'll do is I'll click up here where I have it pinned and uh, oops, that's the wrong one here. It's right here and we'll hit run AMZ Scout Calculator and now we can see all of these fees. So I already entered in information, but we're gonna do this again and make sure it's accurate. And so what we can see here is Amazon takes $5.65 in fees. The two biggest ones are the fulfillment fee, which is the fee Amazon takes every time a product is shipped from their warehouse and the employee has to pick, pack it, and ship it. They have to pay for shipping in a box. And so that's what that is. The referral fee is generally 15% of the sale price. So I'm assuming $1.75 is 15% of this number of the sale price, $11.65. And so those are some of the fees. There's also a monthly storage fee in Amazon's warehouse. It will They will charge you a certain amount for uh, monthly storage per unit. If we're going to try and break down, all right, we already know the Amazon fees. We're going to need a couple other things. For example, the product cost and shipping cost. And the easiest way to do that is take the main keywords, copy them. So 15.5 inch LED baton light. And then we're going to go to alibaba.com, which is kind of like Google for finding manufacturer. You do need an account, which you can join for free by clicking right here. But all we're going to do is paste those keywords and hit search. And we're going to look for a manufacturer so we can get a rough price, a rough uh, estimated price for this product. So if you remember from the listing, it was blue. And so maybe that matters, maybe it doesn't, but we can see some of these can be sourced for $1.50, $4.80, But I want to see one that it actually looked like ours, which was a blue one so what you might have to do is scroll down like this scroll down and find the same type of item so if I look back okay it looks like I have this type of handle it has a button I am fairly confident that we can get this manufactured for about two dollars a piece all right and I am still not really seeing the exact product I'm seeing different colors so maybe I need to go to page two and yeah this looks very similar uh, it's a different color. They say red. So what you might, I might need to do is type in blue LED baton light, and hopefully the actual one will pick up. So I'm going to assume it's about two dollars to manufacture this, based off a lot of these. And so what we'll do here in AMZ Scout, we will enter in that product cost, two dollars, two dollars and zero cents for the product per unit in bulk. Okay. Now this will really matter based on how many units you order, which factory you talk to, and they'll, they'll make you order an, a minimum order quantity or MOQ, which in a lot of cases, this guy's is 500. Uh, this seller's is 100. So you'll need to order a bulk amount to get that price for it to be worth the, their time to work with you. And then for shipping costs, we can sometimes see an estimated shipping cost, but based off my experience, this is 15 inch by one and a half inch product. It's probably cost roughly one or two dollars to ship. So we'll say a dollar fifty uh, using sea shipping. Air shipping would be more expensive. And so we can see here profit per unit is only two dollars and fifty cents. But there's a, one more thing we need to calculate here, which is cost per click, uh, which is an advertising cost. So I'm assuming this seller is running ads to this product on Amazon in order to get sales. So maybe that's a dollar or two. And so quickly we can see that a product like this is not going to be very profitable at the end of the day because there are all these costs and fees in involved in making a sale. Make sure you check out the video appearing on your screen right now so you can continue learning how to start your Amazon business. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.